Welcome back to another episode of Joey Mac and the Adventures of the Shore Shorts. Another squirrely episode because we are on the old uh, H2, if you can't tell, and we got Rav Man with us, so that makes it even a little bit more squirrely. Plus, I got like a really bad head cold, so my balance is really off. Uh, I feel like crap, but we're gonna get this video done because uh, can't go too long without riding, that's for sure. I rested for like two days. I'm like, you know what? I can't sit around any longer. I have to go freaking ride. And Ratman's like, hey, you know, you said you were gonna do. Oh, hang on, this guy drift a little bit here. Whoa, almost crashed. He's like, hey, you said you're gonna do the dirt bike versus street bike video <laughs> in your last video, and I was like, yeah, I know, I said that. And he's like, I think I could take you. And I'm like, no, I don't think you can. He's like, no, I think I could beat you. And I was like, oh, really? So now this is like getting personal. And he's like, yeah, like, I'm almost positive I'm gonna beat you. So I'm like, all right, well, let's do this. So now here we are, riding up into the hill. We're gonna go do some things, you know, some sketchy stuff. So it should be a fun time. Woo! You see what I see, Rap Man? This is where I taught Vroom Vroom Dana how to ride right here. Is it really? He still can't make it up this hill right here. Well, I believe that. Yeah, you, I bet you can believe it. You can make it up it on that thing? I don't know. I mean, this is a dirt bike versus street bike, and you did tell me that you could beat me on the dirt bike on the 110. I could. You I kept know. talking crap. And now, to me, it sounds like you're kind of going back on your word, but I don't know. Uh, No, no, I can still beat you on this thing as long as you're on that. Like that? You said this thing, I shouldn't have any excuses on this because this thing's made for dirt right here. It's made for dirt and it's a ninja. I do got, it's actually the Ninja H2R, so. Ninja H2R. I really don't have any excuses. I just put a brand new dirt tire. I listened to you guys. You said put like the new knobby tire on. So I just got this bad dog right here. And it's super grippy. So we should be good to go. Do you want to try that first wrap, man, or do you want me to go? I think you should go first. That way when you fail, I can show you, you know, how it's properly done. I like your style. But before we get this going, I got to let you guys know, this video is sponsored by none other than PokerStars. <laughs> ah, a boy, PokerStars. Roll the clip. All right, guys, so we're here at the PokerStars app right here. I'm gonna show you guys a little bit about this thing. You could download it in the link below for free. So, it's, there's no excuses why you guys don't think you can beat me. And Ravman, we both play this thing, and we're pretty dang good at it. Here's the free spin you get every four hours, right Ravman? Every four hours you get a free spin to get chips. Look at that, look at that. What's it gonna land on? What is it? 7,000. Okay, okay, I was hoping it was a little bit more, but we got an extra 350, so can't complain about that. I'm gonna show you guys right here. Ooh, we only got three more until the jackpot, jackpot spin. spin. Not bad. So now, if you guys look up here, top left, I, <clears throat> myself, I'm very sick right now. Uh, we are at level five right now. Not too bad, 126,000 in chips right now. So we're gonna go do a little bit of the sit and spin and pr uh, play and pr what's it called? Yeah, a little sit and go. We'll play a little, uh, few hands here. We'll hold them real quick. So you can either click on the play now or hold them. If you click play now, it puts you in the uh, whatever rank for your chip stack. This you get to choose what your uh, buy in and stuff is. Go a little bigger. We'll what start at the, okay, we'll go uh, 20, 20k, 50k buy in, 250, $500 blinds. All right, so we got our two hold cards here, guys. And we're first to act, or second to act, we're after the big one. So we have a queen three. It's, I want to. I wouldn't normally call this, but we are actually in the big blind, so or they made us put in for the big blind already, so we'll we'll check there. Now a jack jack seven flop, obviously we missed it completely. Probably gonna check around. Um, I'd like to show you guys the betting here. So to bet, you start at 500. If you tap it, it'll go up in increments of the big blind. And if you want to go down, you tap below it, and it'll go back down. If you want to go all in, you go all there. You want to bring it back down, you go down. This guy bet 500. We're gonna call him. I wouldn't normally call there, but. You know what, I honestly don't think he has anything. He might have a seven in my opinion. At, at best he has a seven. You wouldn't bet your trip jacks here. I don't, at least I don't think he should, so. Go big or go home, rabbit man. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, there, that's what I'm talking about. All right, these cars, jack seven offsuit, they don't look good, but my absolute luckiest hand I ever had, Joey. This is it, this is our hand right here. 
Are you sure, Evan? Man? I'm sure. I know it doesn't look good. Does I never lose good. with Jack Seven off. Never. I don't even like them suited. I'll fold it if it's suited, but off suit, it's a weaker, weaker hand to start. I know, but oh yeah, this is the hand right all, here. All the way in. Are you sure? All, all in preflop. We can't lose, dude. That's a lot of money, Rev, man. They're either all gonna fold or we're gonna win. We'll probably hit a set straight. You watch. You just watch. Okay. Oh, 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 oh that so guy he thinks called. he's gonna beat us. We have. Oh, oh, we have two overs. We're good. Jack oh, told you. Jack. Oh bango my God, with Rev, the bango. What? That's how you win a big hand. Jack seven never fails. Are nice. you kidding me Got right you to now, level six now? You're catching up to me. You are like a poker pro just oh. for playing this app. Just from this app. This app is by far the best poker oh app God. on the market. I've played a lot of them. I've played all of them probably. The easiest one to bet. Look at up, down. It's so simple. All in. Bring it back down. Fold your cards there. All right. We're back. Hope you guys enjoyed the Poker Stars app. Super fun. Uh, me and Rap Man, we honestly play it a lot ourselves. We like it. We enjoy poker. So I figured instead of selling out something dumb, I figured you guys would really enjoy that because it's something I enjoy. We kind of like the same stuff. So since you guys watched that, we, myself and Rap Man, are going to send it up this thing, which I don't know if it's a good idea now that I've been staring at it. Oh, that's not the starter. The horn. Oh. It doesn't want to start now. That sucks. I can't do it. It doesn't want to start. Dang it. Oh, shoot. Okay. Looks like it's on. So I just want you guys to see this. I'm not like messing around. This is not like something small. It's a good like four feet of vert right there. <clears throat> Excuse my cough. Yeah, I don't know. The more I look at it, the more I don't think it's doable. But, you know, if you got... I think if you just don't look at something, then you're probably, probably better off. We're sending it to the top, lady boys. Woo! Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no! That was sketchier than that. All right. That was nice. That wasn't that bad. Going up there, um, I was a little scary. But you didn't, I mean, I'm going up right over here, like I was saying. You're going up right here. Oh, you are talking about that one. Yeah, that was the first challenge. You, you're always trying to, you know, go one up on everyone and go on something crazy right away. Oh, I thought you were talking about that one the whole time. I'm really pointing over there, so I'll see if I can get over there. Okay. We'll still be tied. Let's see. I think I got this one. All right, we'll see if you can make it. Oh, he's talking about the wrong, he's talking about the wrong one. Oh, hey, you did it. Okay, so we're tied. One for the dirt bike, one for the street bike. Yep. You, you impressed me. That was pretty good. I didn't know that you were talking about the smaller one, though. That would have been nice to know. Yeah, that was definitely what I was pointing at. So, uh, yeah, that's a tie, dude. You, you, you know, you all, right. all right, all right. The next challenge is this trail right here. I haven't taken many people up it only because... It's a serious trail. It's not like a trail riding trail where you're just like, oh, out for a Sunday ride. It's pretty serious on any bike you ride it. So I figured, you know, you're you're on a bike that's made for the street. It's not made for the dirt. So yeah. I figured it would be a good good challenge, you know? So that's just an easy little hill, huh? You, you just, you know, no problem. Like a fire road. Like a Cruise fire. right up it. All right. It looks kind of gnarly. Uh... I'll follow you up it. How about that? Yeah. <laughs> Rabbit Man is on to the whole game where you're like, oh, I'll follow you. It'll be great. Because he knows that I'm following him because I think he could possibly crash and it'd be good content. Dana does the same thing. It's just when you're seasoned, uh, seasoned motorcycle vlogger, whatever you want to call us. Uh, whoa. That's just kind of what you do. You're like, oh, I'll follow you. It'll be great. And then you get the good content. So Ratman's on to that deal. He's like, yeah, yeah I know this is going to be gnarly because you want to follow me. Ooh, this is pretty hairy. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <coughs> oh, wow. He is going. I wish we got a better run at it. God. Ow. Okay. Oh yeah. I'm telling you guys, she climbs just like she climbs like a freaking pack mule. Just up anything. Yeah. 
up, man. Keep it going. Yeah. He's scared now. H2R is behind him. What are you going to do, Rat Man? Where are you going to run to? Uh oh. This thing is so squirrely. All right, so you did good going up the hill. You surprised me, but the next challenge is gonna be a race. Okay. All right, are you ready for this? Yeah, I'm ready to race you. I'm thinking it's about probably a half mile of windy hills right here, big bumps, sketchy cliffs. And I'm going to give you 10 second head start. There's a fence down there that you're going to have to get to before I do. So do you think you could do it? To a fence, through a rutted out, windy. You have no clue where you're going right now. No I know the trail a little bit, so that's my advantage. This path takes me right to the fence. It takes you straight to the fence. Don't get off it. Don't get off it. And it's just windy, rutted out, boulders. <laughs> yes, yeah. yes. Very right. sketchy. 10 second head start. 10 second. You think you could do it? I think I can do it. I'm up for the challenge. All right. Let's do it. Woo. Dirt bike versus street bike challenge number three. Oh. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. What do you guys think? Comment down below what if you guys think I could catch Rabbit Man by time. Oh man, he's getting far. That's about 10 seconds. <laughs> If you guys can think I can catch Rabbit Man. Oh, 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 oh. Oh shit, we're bottoming out. We're clicking second gear for this. Oh, oh. Oh man. Probably isn't a good idea. Oh, there's the fans, I see it! We're striking distance, guys! Oh! Oh! You passed me at the end. Wow. I wasn't sure. I didn't know if I should just hit the fence wide open. Yeah. I mean, I was supposed to touch the fence. Touch it, see? Huh. I mean, you passed me at the end, but I was slowing down because the rules weren't really clear of touch it or what. No, I understand. But, damn. You flew down that hill. Oh, yeah. I was just like, all right, we're going to put it all on the table and we're just going to fucking send it. Yeah. You were coming down. I thought I had it. I was cruising and I heard you behind me. I was like, uh oh. <laughs> I just got that one <laughs> I think you won that one. I think the dirt bike won that one. I think I did. I Damn it. I'll give that was good. Back. Good job. All right, guys. So we're cruising right here. Um, I had I had the camera off. We went through some cartel territory. What's that? You see the cartel back there? Yeah. They're all growing and everything. They're growing. There's a little fire. They're screaming at us, and then they jumped in the car and they're running across this top. Uh, ledge right here. I think they're trying to get to us, so I just wanted to chill here for a second, go up and see what um, see what it looks like. We'll see what's going on. There's a big grow operation. They had a little fire going. Yeah, that's some weird stuff. We're gonna roll up here. Oh, <laughs> the only time we're unarmed, and then we got the cartel on us. Damn. I seen him running across this top lip right here. Do we roll up to the top, cut them off, and see what the heck's going on? Confront them? Or do we hide from them? <laughs> Let's go see what's going on. There they are up there. They missed us. Look at that. They went too fast. They thought we were going down there. Suckers. 
Maybe next time, low life cartel. All right, we cleared a bullet on that one, literally, because they have like a massive grow operation going on. These are the sketchy jumps right here where I blew my ribs out. <laughs> All right, so we're tied right now. Well, no, we're not tied. You're up by one point right now. We've done three challenges. I say we do a fourth one here and see if I can maybe come back and tie this thing up. I'm ready. We're going to do a slow race. All right. All right. So we're going to start here. Last one to that sign right there, that for sale sign wins. You think you can hang? I can hang. You think so? Alright. So. Alright. We're gonna we're gonna figure this out right now. So we're gonna go on the horn. Are you ready for this? On the horn of the bike? Yes. Alright. If my bike starts up. Okay. <coughs> ready. Set. <coughs> oh. Ratman's been in a lot of these slow race competitions. You can't put your feet down and you gotta go as slow as possible. He's at a little bit of an advantage because I'm riding about a three, four hundred pound street bike right now. But we're not coming up with any excuses here. Oh, oh, oh. See, now I get behind him and push him a little bit. Make him mess up. Oh, foot down. Foot down. Woo! That's a wrap. Ah. All right. So, took the win on that. We are tied up. Uh, my cold is getting to me. I feel like crap right now, so I gotta head back. Got a bad headache. Probably not good to ride when you're sick. <laughs> but we gotta come out here and just send it for you guys. So here's the deal. We are gonna do. We're tied up right now. We gotta figure out which one is better, the street bike or the dirt bike. So top five challenges that you guys can come up with. The best ones were the ones that we actually do. I'm gonna give you guys either shirts, goggles, or glasses. It'll just be random. I'll pick random winners. You guys gotta come up with the best challenges for us to do though. We're actually gonna do them, so come up with something sick. I'm gonna go home and rest up for this challenge video. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. I'll see you guys in a couple <laughs> days. My boy's going out. Peace out, lady boys.